He dug deep. He wanted to win. Uh, he's a real horse, and um, the day when you know he can roll along on speed, and uh, he'll run a mile, mile and a quarter down the track, and uh, it's a, it was a big challenge for him today to come out of you know maiden grade at Hawkesbury, come here for a Group Three, and had to ride him a bit different. So um, it was plenty. Only for him to learn, you know, and he, he did a great job because he wants to be a racehorse, he wants to win, he wants to stick his neck out, and Tom gave him a beautiful ride and taught him plenty. What did you think when Tommy popped off the fence to be there? Yeah, look, he, I thought that they hadn't gone that quick, and I would have been more than happy if Tom sort of let him roll on a little bit earlier because that's what sort of horse he is, you know, he wants to stride out, and but um, he got, you know, I think Tommy probably rode him as if he was always confident he was going to get there, and fair play to Ado as he's always hard to run by, and... Um, uh, but he did the job. Well, I think that's the biggest point of them all, isn't it? That m most Waterhouse bot horses have not been run down in that position. No, and especially on a day where it does look to be an advantage mm. to be on the rail. So, um, you know, we're happy with our bloke. He's made a great transition. He's been on upward spiral and he's got a very bright future. And you'll lock in the champagne. It's not about the size, it's over a mile. No, we just want them other fellas to beat each other up next week, have yeah. a hard run, you know, yeah. get, get into the trenches and we'll just come up in the champagne with a bit of fresh legs and a nice young colt on the way up. Well, just on that, uh, will he come through that run uh, as you would expect, uh, knowing how he, he pulled up? Yeah, no, I think that um, that would actually help him. Mm. You know, he had a nice little can of the turn to sprint home, so I think you'll derive plenty of benefit for him. You get a nice kick out of that, and we're ready to put the pedal down on him going into the champagne. Great job. Cheers now. Here's Tommy. What a tough win, Tommy. He was on the canvas three or four times down the straight. I know it was only a bare margin, but what were your thoughts? Yeah, I just I pulled up with a lot of admiration for the horses. Um, there's so much more under the bonnet than what you've seen today. A few things against him. Obviously, uh, he's gone from a soft track to a firm deck, and he handled that quite well. I think he'll be better when he draws out a little bit, can take time to get into his spot where today we drew in and we had that pressure from outside and he's got such a big stride. I heard John say on radio this morning, eight metre stride length, like them horses just need a bowl along and get into a rhythm. So he's, just, he's a winner, he knows how to win and great training performance by John and great for these connections as well. Um, they put a lot of money into racing and it's good to see him get, get another nice one. All right, mate. Cheers.